Hi guys, my name is Jovi. Welcome back or welcome to my channel. Guess what? We're doing another Louis Vuitton unboxing. Stay tuned and find out what it is. ordered this piece last week i can't believe i was able to find it it's crazy how we've been able to find all these pieces um during this time that we've been locked up at home um but i was excited because i've never seen this piece in person i feel like all the pieces i've ordered this week I've never seen in person. So it comes in the original Louis Vuitton box. Um, they didn't put any ribbon on, on this one. So, um, and I did get the receipt here, but we all know what's in there. This bag. Okay. Here it is. It comes in individual dust bags, so you guys probably already know what's in here. So it comes in one, two, and three. It's the multi pochette accessoire. And the color khaki wow this is so beautiful this is the green color it says louis vuitton oh, this is really really nice i like this green let me just look at it i just received it today you know what the crazy thing is um i was so glad i received it today uh, and as of today, today is Tuesday, what day is the day? Uh, May 5th, um, Louis Vuitton actually did another rate increase. Can you guys believe that? Another one. There was one in March, now one in May. And are we going to get one in November again? Like what's going on Louis Vuitton? Like, you know, they keep raising these prices. I can't believe this bag has gone up more than $300 since it was release back in September and it's such a hard piece to get I, I before I got it right now I would ask my CA if you know what were the chances of me even getting this piece and she would tell me um, to be honest it's slim to none you know and of course we didn't know that this whole thing was gonna happen and now you know they've been closed for what almost two months and so I guess they didn't have another choice and to bring these pizzas uh, on the website for people to buy them. But um, I can't believe it's been, you know, how much they go up in price. So it does come with a little booklet and the, the regular pochette has that um, regular fabric inside with a little uh, slip pocket here. And let me see where this one was. This was made in France. Let me see the date code on here. Then the 12th week of this year. I, I really like the um, little vaquette up that this one has on here. So this is the regular pochette uh, size. I am loving this strap. This strap, I love the color. It's so nice. So it does come with the little, let me show you guys. The little vaqueta straps, I mean vaqueta tabs right here, and it has that gold shiny hardware, and it comes with the little uh, vaqueta tab right here with another shiny hardware uh, where you're going to hook the coinster, and then it comes with that little, you know, adjuster there. Okay, let's get to the other pieces. Let's see. So I, this is the mini pochette. ta -da! Oh. Wee. Is this piece 
damage. Okay, so it does come with the two um, clasps right here. That one and then this one. And then the chain. The chain is removable. Nice. This is a nice chain. Can I put the chain on here? Why is it? Oh, duh. You guys can't remove it. Hello. And it comes uh, with the shiny hardware. So I noticed this one has the shiny hardware. Did I say that already? I don't remember. I noticed it has the shiny hardware um, compared to my old, my, because I also got the pochette accessories and the medium pochette. And that one doesn't have as shiny of a hardware as this one here. So this one here also has the, uh, that, the canvas inside. And it just says Louis Vuitton Paris, made in France. This one does not have a date code. And um, I'm looking at it because I feel like it looks, can you guys see that? It looks like it's like wrinkled right there. I don't know if that's how they are. Hmm. Louis Vuitton, Louis Vuitton. You know their quality? I can't believe some of these things actually get out of their warehouse, but you know, I feel like they don't care anymore. We keep buying them, they keep they keep putting them out. I also like how this one has the um the Vaqueta, the Vaqueta tab right there. I feel like that makes a big difference on these pochettes. Alrighty, the last piece is going to be Wow, this is a big dust bag just for that little tiny piece right there. Ta -da! The monogram coinster. This is so cute in person. You know, it has the little um, clasp right there with the shiny hardware also. It has the small um, monogram on one side and it has the larger monogram on the other a nice shiny zipper and inside it has a kind of like a wipeable interior where you could wipe it I don't think I would ever use this for um, for coins I wouldn't want the residue on there um, and it does say in the back, made on in France, if you guys can see that there. This is really, really cute. I just want to look at these pieces. Like I said, I just got them today. So um, I just opened it and I wanted to just inspect them. Um, hmm. Okay. You guys look at this coinster. I hadn't. Look at this. I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see. I don't know what you guys can see. Um, but you see how it's the gold um, hardware. If you guys see somewhere around there, it has a little gray area. So it's crazy how this is brand new and it's already um, getting discolored and I am not happy with that for the price that we're paying for these bags so also the back of here you see how this is crinkling I wonder if this is this is how it is I don't feel like it should be that way but I don't know, maybe because of the way that it hangs. Okay, let's put it together. I'm sorry, this video is taking too long. Okay, I'm going to put it together. Uh, and then we're going to see how it looks. Okay, so let's see. So I'm assuming the mini pochette goes attached to the rings right here. Attach this one here. So I'm going to attach it there. I really like this chain, so nice. And then we're going to attach this here. Alrighty, so this is how it looks. 
it is definitely a cute piece i'm not going to lie it's really really cute i am really loving this green color but then again i i like anything i don't know the green color um if you guys watch my um what's coming what's new to louis vuitton you guys probably saw that i was talking about how for some reason when it, when i see something in green like it calls my name and i kind i've always wanted a um a green purse but i'm scared i typically always tend to go for neutral colors black now you know the monogram and i'm always scared of going into bright colors because i feel like i'm never going to use the purse but um i feel like this having this green strap definitely gives you more color and i really really like it i really like this green strap it is definitely a cute bag i can see why it's so it's such in high demand with people wanting it i feel like the coinster i really really love if i could i would just get the coinster probably the strap as well i did however if you guys saw that um that video again um they are coming up with the strap and the coinster but i heard that the strap with the coinster is going to be like 800 like 800 to 850 dollars so outrageous for a coinster and a strap so might as well just keep the two purses you know what i mean so i don't know if i'm going to be keeping it to be honest with you guys i am um i'm gonna have to think about it i'm gonna have to call them and see if if they can do something about that and i definitely don't if i'm gonna keep it i don't want to return it because i do not want to pay the higher amount that it just went out today so um, I need to call them and let them know that there's some issues with the quality that I got this purse um, today. So I'm going to I'm going to show you guys how it looks on my body frame. Um, the whole reason why this purse was a no for me before is because I, I am a I am a heavier person and I do have I am heavier, especially in my chest area. And I didn't know how it would look on me um, because of the strap and, you know, and it's very short but um i'll go ahead and show you guys how it looks okay guys hi <laughs> i'm gonna show you guys how this purse looks on my body frame um i i do like how it fits um i don't know how i feel about this here kind of you know just hanging on on here like i don't know but then again you know with this i can remove it so let's see how it looks removed so this is how it looks by itself just you know what i feel like if you remove it it kind of like takes that look off i don't know now i feel like i like it better with it okay so um i don't i i like how it i it's weird i feel like i don't like how it looks with this on here but then i don't like how it looks without it so i guess i like it better with it so it hits right above my hip and then I could lower it if I wanted to a little bit more. I do, however, have it almost at the um, lowest. I, it can't really go any high. Um, I could go lower if I wanted to. But I feel like this chain here makes it a little bit more cuter. If you, you could remove it if you wanted to. But then I feel like I like, I like the chain. Honestly, I think that every piece to this um, purse, it's on there for a reason. I know you can take it apart and make it anything you want, but I think that every piece that's on here is for a reason. It Because to me, if I take the chain off, it kind of looks different and I don't like how it looks. I like how it looks with the chain. And even though like this whole coinster thing here, at first i was like eh, i don't like it but when i took it off i like it with the coinster there so um but once again i don't know if i'm keeping this one um i do feel like it's damaged on on the bottom on that side right there but um we'll see we'll see okay guys that was it for this uh unboxing and first impressions um if you like the video go ahead and hit the thumbs up if you like my channel um, and want to continue joining me, uh, go ahead and click the subscribe button and I'll see you until the next one. Thank you and have a great day. Goodbye.